Hey there friends, Martin here and today I just wanted to briefly talk about a feature of my favorite animating software iClone that I didn't mention properly in my earlier videos. Since making the mini introductory course for Character Creator and iClone and then a video breaking down the latest additions to version 8, I came to realize that there is one particular feature that opened up so many possibilities to me. And it is from Roll. Yes, the ability to import any animation using most formats and most online mocap databases. I mean, this ability is present in many animation tools, even in Blender. Nevertheless, rarely, well, to be honest, never, have I ever seen it so quick and reliable as it is now in iClone. Basically, you can easily download, purchase or generate any animation or motion capture data from anywhere. And especially when using an FBX format, you basically just drag and drop the animation file onto your character in iClone, the import dialog is then automatically set up and you are good to go. This obviously works very well with any animation files exported from iClone or downloaded from their ActorCore mocap database. However, if you try other tools, like in my case Rococo software, it works flawlessly as well, especially in the FBX format, as I mentioned. If you choose something else, uh, like the BVH, you will need to do some setting up. But uh, why would you, when FBX works so well? And the same case is for example the Mixemo tool, where you can simply download the actor without skin, set up everything as simply as this, and then again drag and drop onto your character in iClone. And I had similar smooth experience all over, uh, from Rokoko mocap database, when using files from CG Trader, or anything exported from Autodesk tools. I am constantly amazed how well this feature works, and along with some other features that I've talked about in the previous iClone video, it really expanded the possibilities for mixing many animations in my future videos. And that, my friends, is why I decided to make this short video on the topic. Feel free to watch my free introductory course on using Reillusion tools, because yes, they're expensive, but awesome for anyone who wants to start animating without really being an animator. These tools, after all, were the real reason why I was able to do the Heroes of Bronze short film on my own. And that's it for today. Until next time, Martin out.